Hi, I am Aini Ruzaini, a third year dental student. In this video, I will explain about the pulmonary tuberculosis and the radiographic finding in recovered primary tuberculosis. What is tuberculosis? It is an airborne disease caused by Mycobacterium tuberculosis. Pulmonary tuberculosis is the infectious disease primarily affecting lung parenchyma. It is transmitted from person to person by a droplet nuclei containing the organism and is spread mainly by coughing. Transmission occurs when a person inhales droplet nuclei containing Mycobacterium tuberculosis by mouth or nasal passages and then travel to the upper respiratory tract and bronchi to reach the alveoli of the lungs where they invade and replicate within alveolar macrophages. Pulmonary tuberculosis can result from primary infection, which means that it is the first time the host is seeing the infection. Or, it may be secondary infection, which results from reactivation of dormant infection or infection from second source in a person who had a prior infection. What can we hear from lung auscultation in pulmonary TB patient? With secondary tuberculosis, we can expect bronchial breathing sound. This is due to consolidation area of the lung, lung cavity, and lobar collapse with patent bronchus. We can also expect crepitations with increased vocal resonance on auscultation due to lung cavities. Hi, this is Ahmad. He has a history of pulmonary tuberculosis. One day, when he was dozing off at his work table, suddenly, his tooth ached so much that he woken up from his sleep. On the next day, he went to the dentist. What can we see from Ahmad's chest x-ray? Following an immune response to primary infection, a casein granuloma forms which calcify over time. This is known as a going focus, which means that the TB has gone. A going focus is a rounded, well-defined focus of calcific density usually located in the periphery of the lung. That's all for me. Thank you.